Hi everyone, it's Steph. Welcome back to the channel. I hope you're doing well. So today I thought I would let you all follow me around on my day of lockdown, what, I'm, what I do during the day um, whilst we're in lockdown considering that I'm back in the shielding group. Um, and yeah, so it's literally, what time is it now? It's like quarter to 10 in the morning. I've already done quite a bit to be fair, um, but that's only because I've been up a while um, thanks to my joints, my joints keep dislocating. Um, we're having one of those days and Fudge is being a pain in the backside. So today's plan is pretty much trying to sort the conservatory out but with how much my joints are dislocating I don't know how much I'm gonna get done. Um, and then as well as sorting out the conservatory I've just got like a couple of other bits I need to do. I need to start getting some bits on eBay as well. Try and take the dog out at some point. I think that's about it. Is there anything guys I need to do? No, I think that's it. So I'm in the conservatory, not gonna lie, it's an absolute mess in here. Um, the dehumidifier's on, which is what you can hear in the background. And um, basically I've got that box to sort out there. Um, Cause I, I just wanna try and get like, as many of the little boxes kind of sorted out as possible. So eventually this lot will go. I mean, a lot of this is just like packaging and stuff that's up here now. Um, but eventually most of this will go. Um, obviously that's staying because that's my chair. That ottoman stay in. Um, bean bag and power plate and all that stay in. Uh, flooring, like I'm just basically seeing how many like squares we need of the flooring for the gym workout area. Um, got my laminate over in the background somewhere over there and the spare ones from the bedrooms um, just sat there because that's going in the office on the office side of the of the conservatory. Um, and then I basically got to paint. So hopefully when we, hopefully when I film the conservatory update, it'll, it won't look like this. <sighs> well, that's the box sorted through. I've put a couple of bits on eBay, but oh my God, the pain I am in right now. And my joints literally keep trying to pop out. So I'm like, no, no, please don't. Just leave me alone. So I'm gonna go rest um probably take some stuff like put some stuff on the bed that i want to put on ebay and just lay down on the bed and um try and pop them on um ebay from bed but i've gotten quite a bit of them done so like these are the bits that are already on ebay right i've calmed down after that debacle um just ordered fudge a load of calming um, medication and stuff to go on top of his Zilkeen that he's already on um, and I've got like a pet diffuser as well so that should be coming soon but I might get like another one just for now but at the moment Fudge is I don't even think you can see him under there um, I've just been in bed resting doing stuff on the laptop um, sorting plans and things out i really need to go and do more in the conservatory but to be fair i'm in so much pain i just can't be bothered pain levels are up moods and like a, i'm in a really bad mood um and the diffuser's still on, like the dehumidifier is still on um because i try and have that on for like 12 hours a day now um facing into the conservatory just to get as much of the moisture out of there as possible but apart from that, there's not there's not really much else to update you all on. So, oh, still in bed, still in a lot of pain. Uh, having dinner now, but Fudge is like clearly after it, as you can see. Um, my bedroom is such a mess. I've got to get it sorted out. The conservatory and the living room are my main priorities right now. So, yeah, I'm just gonna have my dinner. I'm having peppered beef chipolatas with like chopped up with beef not beef um tomato onions like just a bit of onions and mushrooms um and some herbs so basic but keto friendly and given that i've been back on like probably back on my diet now for the last week um yeah i feel i i definitely feel like my inflammation levels are coming down a bit it's just when I'm, it's just because they're coming down, I'm then trying to push myself to do more. Didn't end up doing, like, taking Mr. Out or doing my role. Uh, mainly because of the weather, but also just because of how I am. Um, 
Yeah, I'm going to enjoy my dinner, the rest of it that I have before the dog gets it. And then figure out what to do next. Well, we're just waiting for six o'clock to come to feed this one. But I thought I'd go in the conservatory because I managed to find a way to get um, some electric going into there so I can have the door shut with the dehumidifier one. So I'm going to shuffle my way into there and I'll show you how full this dehumidifier is, bearing in mind that I emptied it this morning. Okay, so this is the dehumidifier, just casually now sat in the middle of the conservatory. And it got emptied this morning. Look how full that bad boy is. It's like halfway full. Um, but yeah, as I say, I've managed to figure a way of getting um, some electric into the conservatory just to get this running so hopefully if I can keep this running now it will drag a lot of the liquid out of the walls and just get rid of a lot of the condensation problem that we've got in here um, and then I'll be able to get my electrics redone get my painting done get the flooring down um, once this has been cleared because dad's doing the painting for me and helping um, with the flooring and then hopefully we'll be able to get the sofa in here get the desk in here get the stuff from lock and store over and we'll basically have a home office workout area so fudge is eating his dinner and um we're actually still in the process of moving his food across so i thought whilst um he's eating i can get on with making his next four days worth of food um because of where we're reducing his biscuits um his old biscuits to his and then increasing his new ones and there we have fudge's next four days of food complete so he's having 12 grams of his new food and three grams of his old food for the next four days and then we drop it from uh three to two and then um two to one and then he'll finish so hopefully it will be okay um i'm hoping Look where I just found my little Chi Chi. Fudge has cuddled himself under my dressing gown. Like, that's adorable. It's so cute. I love him to bits. Hey, you gonna say hi? Oh, he's so tired. He is more than ready for bed. I am about to get ready for bed. Um, I'm gonna watch I'm a Celebrity in bed and then probably go to sleep. So, um... I'm gonna, yeah, I'm gonna end this video here. I hope you enjoyed seeing what we pretty much get up to during lockdown. I think we literally covered pretty much most of what we do, apart from the fact that we would normally go on a little outing, but with the weather and just how my joints were, it, it wasn't gonna happen today. My joints have been absolutely horrific. Um, but I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, I hope you're going to look forward to the next one. I'm going to aim to upload every Wednesday and Saturday from now on. So you'll get two videos a week on the lifestyle channel. Um, the travel channel, I mean, the for like the travel videos and things and the blog. I mean, don't ask me what's going on. It'll come back when it comes back, you know. Um, I am trying to get content out. But. It, I'm always in like two minds as to whether to post content or not just because of the current situation however I will probably be posting content in the next like week or two um definitely before the end of this month I will post at least a blog post and um a video review to the travel channel so make sure you're following that one as well and yeah take care for now and see you all in the next video bye